everyone. I'm Denise Salcedo, and standing with me right now is Christopher Rob Bowen. Christopher, it's so nice to see you here Thank at you. Up Next Fighting. Uh, man, is this your first UNF event? It is. It is. I, I uh, My buddy, Chris LeVar, I think has been to a couple, and he invited me and said ringside. I said, absolutely. Sign me up. I'm yeah. there. Yeah. How do you, you're going to be cage side. Yeah. How do you feel about being that up close to the violence, to the fighting? I'm just wondering if I should have brought like, a, you know, one of those rain jackets or something in case of blood fly. I don't know. I'm cool, though. I'm cool with it. Blood doesn't freak me out as, you know, keep myself clean. That's it. Yeah. Are yeah. You, so are you a big MMA fan? Are you a casual fan? What's your what's your fan status? Um, I'm a casual fan. I love it, and I've met, uh, you know, I've met a few guys, Nate Diaz, and a couple of these other guys that grew, that came up in, in uh, UFC and stuff. But it, uh, if it's on TV, I'll watch it. I love it. But uh, so it's great to be at an actual live event. So I'm excited. So let me ask you: If you were a fighter, let's just say you were about there to about to step into that cage, kick some butt, what would be your theme song? Rocky's been overplayed. So uh, my theme song would be. Stir Fry by Migos. Oh, all right. Get a nice yeah, beat going. Yeah. Get a nice intro. All right. Do you think you'd be a grappler? Do you think you'd be a striker? What would be your style? I would definitely be a grappler because I'm very, uh, I'm like Gumby. You know, I'm still, even at, at my age and I'm older, I'm, still, I'm super flexible. Um, so I think I'd be like in the holds and chokes and, you know, arm bars and, you know, like a little monkey down there running around. So. <laughs> Man, we would pay good money to see that. We'd pay good <laughs> yeah, money to I see bet. that. Uh, Christopher, talk to us about some of the projects that you're working on right now. What's going on? What's on yeah. the schedule? So I have uh, four, you know, I've kind of moved from, from acting to producing. So I've done movies with Bruce Willis and Robert De Niro and Jeffrey Dean Morgan and some of these guys, which has been awesome. But uh, I decided I wanted to get into producing. So about four or five years ago, I started uh, producing stuff. And so I've got four projects lined up. But I'm not leaving acting behind. I'm, I'm going to be starring in, in, in the movies with opposite... Uh, well, I can't say yet, but uh, oh, hopefully okay. opposite some really A-list actors that you know. Okay. So I got a couple coming up in Oklahoma, uh, hopefully towards the end of this year. But with the strike, it kind of sucks, but uh, but we'll figure it out. So exactly. yeah. Exactly. It'll hopefully all get figured out. Yeah. And you know, I do want to ask you, what's the difference between, uh, you know, creatively, what's the difference between being on screen and acting, and then being behind the scenes and being the producer? It's it's very different. It's like a it's it's a 180 really because and, and it's it's hard sometimes because I've produced a few projects already and to uh, put on the acting hat and then take it off and try not to focus because one is very creative and one is very intellectual. So you know, producing is a very intellectual, following, making sure people are doing what they're supposed to be doing, doing all the numbers and crunching and paperwork, and it's like. Uh, I'd much rather be doing acting, but uh, but producing is a fun gig. I enjoy it. So yeah, it's like a different satisfaction, right? Like a it's different creative totally high. Totally different. It's, and to be able to see not just something that you've been in, but like, hey, I produced that. I help cast these actors. I help with the writing of that. So it's it's really rewarding in that way. So I can only and imagine. you guys watch for trunks um, and asphalt coming out soon. So. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah. I do have one final question. Yeah. I just thought about it right now. It's the most serious question you'll ever be asked. And oh, that is, oh, oh, man. if you were to step into that cage with another actor, who would you want it to be? Brad Pitt. Oh, you had your answer ready. I, I'm ready. Bring it on, baby. <laughs> All right, everybody. Christopher Rob Bowen. We'll catch you guys next time. Thank you, everyone. Thanks.